Hi Capricorns, this is Keep It Real with your reading for October 11th to October 14th, 2021. Capricorns, I hope all is well with you guys. I hope you're staying protected, blessed, prayed up. Okay, and positive and keep your guards all the way up, Capricorns, okay? All right, Capricorns. Spirit guys, my God, the angels, earth angels, ancestors. What is going on in my Capricorns life? My beautiful Capricorns. What is going on in my beautiful Capricorns life? Spirit guys, my God, the angels, earth angels, ancestors. My God, the angel, Holy Spirit. What is going on in my beautiful Capricorns life? What are my Capricorns thinking, feeling, doing? What are they up to? What are they going through? Capricorn spirit guys. Capricorns. What are the messages for the Capricorn spirit guys? My God, you do have angels, ancestors. Okay, Capricorns. You have four cups. What's going on, my Capricorns? This is a cancer you're dealing with, Capricorn, or you got cancer in your chart. Someone's feeling disappointed, upset, mad. Someone feels used, betrayed, lied to. You thought something was going to go in your favor, Capricorn? A job or a contract? Some type of, I don't know, career or something that you thought was going to go in your favor? You was, it could be, I don't know, job, relationship? We got a king of swords. So Capricorn, are you upset because of Aquarius cutting you off? We got Aquarius. The Aquarius demanding respect. You dealing with Aquarius? Oh, the Hierophant. Capricorn. So, okay. This is the Cancer. Taurus. So, something ain't going in someone's favor. Okay. It can be this Cancer mad because something ain't going in their favor or this be you, um, Capricorn. Okay. Spirit guys, I got an angel, or angel ancestors. What is going on in my Capricorns life, Spirit guys? What are the messages for my Capricorns, for my beautiful Capricorns? What are the messages for my beautiful Capricorns, Capricorns, Capricorns? For October 11th to October 14th, 2021, Capricorns. What is going on with my beautiful Capricorns? Capricorns, okay. All right, my Capricorns, let's do this. Capricorns, let's see what's going on, my Capricorns. My Capricorns. Capricorns, this is a seven of wands. You feel like you need to protect yourself from a Leo. You feeling guarded from a Leo. You feel like you need to protect your energy, your space, or whatsoever. This is a Leo feel this way towards you, Capricorn. They feel guarded. They feel like they need to protect themselves from you. They feel like they need to guard themselves from you or these people. Capricorn, you feel like you need to protect yourself from these strange, suspicious-looking people around you or whatsoever, okay? Capricorn, if you got to protect yourself, protect yourself, okay? From a Leo, okay? Or a Leo fitting this way about you, Capricorn. You don't trust a Leo or something like that, okay? We got the Three of Swords, Libra. Okay, we got the Virgo Capricorn, the Hermit card. This is a Virgo watching you behind scene. I don't know what this Virgo. Ooh, ooh, wait. Okay, I see what this Virgo doing, Capricorn. Hmm. This Capricorn, Capricorn, this goddamn Virgo doing magic on you. Ain't this a bitch? Ain't this a bitch? Capricorn, you got a Virgo that's doing fucking magic on you, doing spell work on you behind the motherfucking scene. Doing gray y'all spell work. Yes. They are doing magic on you. Spell work. Okay? It can be any kind of magic. All right? Good or bad. But it's a Virgo that's behind scene watching you. Being sneaky in the motherfucker. Doing readings on you. Getting readings on you. Spying on you. Watching you. Doing uh, spells, you know, black magic on you. You know, spells on you. Control spells, binding spells, love spells, uh, binding spells, uh, come to me spells, um, beauty spells, all types of ritual spell work on you, Virgo. I mean, on you, uh, Capricorn. This Virgo. 
I don't know. Someone's trying to. Yes. Someone is trying to. Dealing with a Pisces Capricorn. Okay, it's a Pisces wants to be have a family with you, want to be a family with you. A Pisces wants to reconcile with you, reunite with you. Virgo, I mean Capricorn. It's a Pisces. Water sign wants to reconcile with you. A Pisces. Oh, okay, I know who that is. So it's a Pisces that loves you, uh, Capricorn, and misses you. And they want to be with you. They want to reconcile with you. They want to reunite with you. They want to see you. They want to be a family all over again with you. Okay, but we got a Virgo that's doing spell work that's keeping you from this Pisces. Okay, you got a Virgo don't want you to be with this Pisces Capricorn. So it's a Virgo that's doing spell work behind scene on you. This is someone watching you doing spell work on you, Virgo. I mean Capricorn. Ten of uh. So this is a Pisces wants to be with you, Capricorn. But it's a Virgo that's doing spell work on you to keep you from being with this Pisces or trying to. Is Virgo jealous of you and his Pisces? Because you have love for this Pisces? Because you love this Pisces? You want to be with this Pisces? Is Virgo doing magic on you? Sex magic? All kinds of magic on you. Three of Swords. This is a Libra. Someone's feeling broken hearted, hurt, lies, deception. Is a Libra feeling broken hearted by you, Capricorn? Or this is you feel broken hearted by a Libra? Someone has someone in a third party relationship, third party relationship, jealousy, envy. Okay. Someone broke someone hard, hurt someone really, really bad. Okay, someone has someone in a third party relationship. This could be a loved one passing on. Someone could be passing away. Sorry for your loss. Oh, oh my god, it's scary. Okay, but Libra, you dealing with a Libra, uh, Capricorn, a, a family member, friend, who was so ever, someone hit you in third party, third party relationship, broke your heart, lies, deceit, just deception, jealousy, and you still hurt by that. You still grieving. You grieving over a Pisces, Capricorn. You got a Leo, Seven of Wands, feeling guarded, feel like you need to protect it. You feel like you need to protect yourself from a Leo, Capricorn. Or Leo feels like they need to protect themselves from you. Someone you don't trust a Leo or a Leo don't trust you, Capricorn. Let's see. We got eight of cups, five of cups, four of swords, six of swords, came man, four of pinnacles, eight pinnacles, four of wands, five of wands, five of pinnacles, the wheel of fortune. The Queen of Pentacles. Okay. Capricorns. All right. Let's do this, Capricorn babies. So, Capricorn, is a Pisces coming towards you. Okay. I don't know what this Pisces coming towards you for. This Pisces on some bullshit with the full moon, with the moon right here, Eight of Cups. This Pisces coming towards you with lies, deceit, money problems, job loss, money loss. Whatsoever hidden genders, motives, and flaws, and all this Pisces is coming with this Pisces is not being honest with you, Capricorn, or this could be you not being honest with a Pisces. But this is a Pisces coming towards you, Capricorn. Okay, this person cannot be trusted or whatsoever. Yes, a Scorpio, you dealing with a Scorpio, uh, Capricorn? This can be you. You five of cups, money losses, relationship losses, you going through a hurt, you broken hearted. Or this can be a Scorpio that's broken hearted. Okay. But also you got this Pisces that's coming towards you, uh, Capricorn, with lies and secrets and shit. And this can be you, Capricorn, with the Scorpio in your chart, feeling hurt, five of cups. Feeling hurt, feeling regretful, okay, about this Pisces or about this Scorpio or who whatsoever. But someone's feeling regretful. Someone's hurt, going through a hurt, going through a loss. Okay? This is someone's grieving. It could be over a job, money, a loss, a relationship. Someone's grieving. Someone's, feel, someone's feeling regretful that they fucked up with you, Capricorn. Or this is you feeling this way. Oh, hold on. It's a four swords. Libra. So... 
A Libra is sick, come down with some sickness and illness. A Libra, or this can be you, Capricorn. You come down with some sickness and illness. You need to meditate. You need to relax. You need to tap off to yourself. Okay? Right. This could be you going through a loss. It could be someone that passed away, Capricorn, that's close to you. Oh, my God. This can be a Libra that passed away, a family member, a friend, or someone that passed away close to you. Capricorn, that's why you're grieving. That's why you hurt. Or this could be you, Capricorn, come down with some sickness and illness, dealing with some depression and stress, dealing with mental illness. Someone's praying. Someone's... This could be death or someone passing away on their sickbed. Six of Wands, Aquarius. So you're thinking about moving towards Aquarius, Capricorn? You're moving to calmer water? Not with Aquarius. Okay, Aquarius. This could be, a, I mean, Capricorn. This could be Aquarius moving towards you, Capricorn. Or this is you moving towards Aquarius. You're moving away. You're getting away from all this bullshit. You need to go somewhere where it's silence. You need peace and harmony in your life, Capricorn. You're moving away. You're going towards Aquarius. You're going towards something. You're going towards somebody. You're just getting away. You need to get away. Or you're going to the hospital. Yeah, this could be you traveling. You want to travel. Like I said, it's going to be Aquarius traveling to see you. Or this could be you, Capricorn. We got the hangman. Uh, okay, we got the hey man. So things are on hold. Relationships, whatever is going on in your life, Capricorn. Shit is out on hold. This could be shit on hold for this Pisces. This Pisces might be receiving a comma. I don't know, but someone, things out on hold. This abuse relationship you in, uh, Capricorn. Someone's in an abuse relationship with a Pisces. Ooh, wait. So you need to postpone this Pisces. You're dealing with a Pisces Capricorn. Something about this Pisces ain't right. This Pisces keeping secrets. This Pisces be carrying could be carrying STDs, HIV, all types of shit with them. And they not being honest with you. So you need to put this Pisces on pause, on hold. Because this Pisces is not being straight honest with you. For real. On everything. Okay? Four of Pentacles. Capricorn is you, baby. You keeping to yourself. You keep your money, your business to yourself. You keep your feelings to yourself. You trying to hold on to someone, Pisces. You trying to hold on to someone, or this um, Pisces trying to hold on to you, Capricorn. You holding on to your money, your information. You're not telling nobody shit. What you doing? What you got? Whatsoever. Like I said, this could be a Pisces trying to hold on to you, okay, or a Scorpio trying to hold on to you, Capricorn. But you're keeping your money to yourself, your business to yourself, okay? you saving money, more money on the way. Right, this is you not giving in to this, um, you're not giving in to this Pisces, Capricorn. So you keep your money to yourself, your feelings to yourself. You're not sharing with this uh, Pisces. Okay. Also, you're not feeling you're not feeling no type of remorse for this cat for this Scorpio. You don't care how this Scorpio feeling right now. You're not you're not you're not caring. You're not trying to say hi. How you doing? Are you okay? You're not doing any of them things, Capricorn. You like you don't give a fuck. It's like you holding on to something. You hold on to your money. Hold on to your feelings. You're not sharing, okay? You holding back from somebody, okay? We got the Eight of Pentacles. So this is you working hard, Capricorn. It's a Virgo working hard towards you to fix a relationship with you, Capricorn. To work on a relationship with you, okay? So you giving you giving a Virgo, you giving a Capricorn of Capricorn. Okay, 
Capricorn, this is a Virgo wants to amend things with you. They want to work on a relationship with you. They want to fix things with you. But you seem like you don't want to fix things with this Virgo, Capricorn. But this this Virgo wants to fix, want to work on things with you. They want to fix this relationship with you. Okay. Okay, we got the four of wands. So this is a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. So you dating a cap you dating an Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Capricorn. So this is your new love, the person that you want to be with, Capricorn. You don't want to be with this Virgo or this Pisces anymore. So you want to be with this uh Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, new love. Uh Marriage, new home, new resident, new mood, traveling to be with each other. Someone's coming to move with who, or you moving with who, or y'all moving together. Like to be your soulmate, your ex, or somebody, a family member, friend, who whatsoever. But you, you be happy. You in a new relationship. You feeling good, Capricorn. New love, new home, new resident, new mood, marriage, uh, family, kids, and all. Okay. Oh, Capricorn, my boo boo. So we got the Fab of Ones. This is a Leo. Oh, he fights an argument with a Leo. Hmm. Fights and arguments with a Leo. Capricorn. It's a Leo star and shit. Keeping the bullshit in the workplace. This could be a family member, friend, or who whatsoever. Or a case with a co worker, somebody that you work with. Or this could be your ex. Y'all could be fighting arguments. Someone's getting caught up like ketchup. This is someone trying to get you fired, Capricorn. Someone's trying to make you lose your job. These enemies and frenemies that's around you in the workplace, in the neighborhood, in the environment, in the building. They give me family or who whatsoever. But this is a Leo starting shit. Likes to star shit. A troublemaker. Uh, uh, attention whore. Uh, a drama queen or king or whatever, however you want to call it. Okay, five of pentacles. Okay, someone's feeling left out in the cold. Okay, this can be you feeling left out in the cold, Capricorn, neglected by this Leo. Okay, so this Leo got you fired. This Leo trying to make you lose your job. This Leo trying to keep people against you. Okay, this can be a Leo. You caught a Leo doing. It's like this Leo just causing, 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 causing problems for you. So you feel abandoned, neglected, unwanted, unloved by this Leo. <clears throat> Someone's feeling homeless, our homeless, put out in the cold, excuse me. Ooh. Oh, shit, that's coming from you guys. This reading, this energy. Okay, someone's feeling left out in the cold, put out, homeless, on the streets. Okay, feeling abandoned by family members or friends or who whatsoever or by a lover. Okay, someone's accusing you. Capricorn, you accusing someone or someone's accusing you? Or this, you feeling hurt, abandoned by this Leo? Will of Fortune. Okay, this is Aquarius, Scorpio, and Taurus, and Leo. So you want to travel, Capricorn? You wants to get away, elevations and money and trips overseas, competition. So someone's trying to compete with you too, Capricorn. Competitions in the workplace, in the job, or a family, who whatsoever. Someone wants to compete with you. It can be, I don't know, you can have a YouTube, uh, Instagram page. I don't know, but you want to travel. You fucking want to travel. You need to get away. You need a vacation. So you want to travel, you need a vacation, Capricorn, or this is a uh, Aquarius, Scorpio, Taurus, Leo that wants to travel, but you wants to see you because you're getting all this money, and they want to be friends with you because they see you getting all this money and gifts and surprises, Capricorn. So now this Aquarius, Scorpio, Taurus, Leo, who so ever wants to be friends with you, wants to come and see you, wants to... Okay, Queen of Pentacles. This is a Capricorn. This is you, Capricorn, baby. You focus on yourself. You're doing self-healing, some self-reflection. You've been through some shit. 
You've been through a lot. Broken heart, heartbroken, stress, worry, abuse, domestic violence, or whatsoever you've been through, Capricorn. You need healing. You're still healing yourself. You're not focused on no one. You focus on your money, your business, yourself, your life. Okay? That's what you focus on, Capricorn. You're not focused on this foolishness. You're trying to heal yourself. You're trying to get your life, your priorities together. That's what you're trying to do. Capricorn. Okay. Fire sign. So I don't know, like I said, I don't know what happened to you in this fire sign or who whatsoever. But now you 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 to yourself, you're alone, you want to be to yourself, you don't want to talk to no one. You just feel like you can't trust no one. I understand, I know how that feel. I really fucking do. But you let me tell you something, Capricorn. Whatever you're going through, get through it. God gonna make sure he see you through it. No matter what. You don't need no motherfucker. You don't need a posse to be, you know, a motherfucking gang, okay? So keep healing, keep doing some meditation, music, or whatever you need to do, Capricorn, to heal yourself. Go jog, go work out, go meditate. Uh, listen to some music, some high vibration music. You know, not no low vibration like sad songs. No, listen to some high vibration music, something that's gonna uplift you. Okay, energize you, keep you energetic, keep you like an energizer battery. You know, keep you focused and, 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 you know, keep you going. Okay? All right, Capricorns. This is y'all reading, babies. I hope all is well with you guys. Okay? Yes, I do. Okay? Stay protected and positive and blessed and prayed up. And keep your guys all the way up. Okay, Capricorns? Smooches. Mwah.